and you, and got, you got phone calls from everyone. But the first lady, Michelle Obama, called you, and Rick Pitino said, you're now the coolest guy he knows. He said, your coach said, the president calling you, okay, fine. He calls sports people, but Michelle Obama? What did you think? I honestly don't even remember speaking to her, but that's what they were telling me, that she called. Please call him back. Please. If she called, please, please call, call again. Please. I really would appreciate it because it's, it's a once-in-a-lifetime thing, you know, and I know the president kind of picked us to lose to Indiana and his bracket, but I forgive him. When I speak to him in the White House, I'll forgive him. You're trash talking talk the President of the United States right now. I just want to kind of make that clear to everybody watching. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> you said you're okay if you never play basketball again. Kind of. I'm, I'm, I wouldn't be. I would be okay with it if I knew that I wouldn't be able to play basketball again. I'm. I'm not okay with like just the fact like, like I'm, I'm injured right now and I won't play basketball again because I will play basketball again. Um, I'm eight to twelve weeks away from this bone being fully healed and rehabbing. I'm gonna rehab as hard as I can and I'm gonna get back on the court like it's no tomorrow. I know patience is key right now and that's one thing I really have to learn. But uh, I just can't wait. Like I really can't wait.